righty, now we're going to wire our second circuit. We're going to put a box up here for some switches. I'm just going to run the power to the switches here. Well, I'm serious. So here in the country I was born in, we use a 14 American wire gauge on 15 amps. So I'm going to put the wire under, make sure I pick it nice and tight up here. The way I'm doing this wiring is according to the NEC, which is the National Electrical Code. junk out of here get all our paper out okay so first we will run our white wire to the neutral bar so we'll get behind everything up here run across and we'll bring it down and I'll go right into this top hole with our 14 gauge hole because we're using 14 wire and we'll be putting it on a 15 amp circuit breaker. Make sure you don't get the insulation under the hole. Now you can put two ground wires in the same lug but when you do that you got to make sure they're both the same gauge. But you can put two ground wires in at the same gauge but only one white neutral wire. Okay, so next we'll bring our ground wire over. Bring up our corner there, bring it down, and we'll go in right here.
Now since this is 14 American wire gauge, we'll use a 15 amp breaker. You'll see it says 15 on the uh, toggle. Sometimes it'll be down here. And it just sets in the box like this. And push it in. Okay, now we'll bring our black wire down. Push it up, get it nice and neat across the top here. And I'll run it down about right here. And up. And I will strip it and run the breaker right here. Strip it about 14 gauge hole. Just strip just enough to get it under the lug. Put our new wire into the first box. We're gonna have two switches in here. Yeah. What time are you to three tomorrow, bud? Uh, probably just in the uh, afternoon. After three? Yeah. Well, I'm going to say more like two. Two? Okay. If I'm not here, Tyler will be here. Okay. Okay. He's going to pull that board up now. Yeah. Upstairs so we can feed that wire through. I'm going to drill okay. the holes. Good. For the lights in that uh, mud room. Okay, good. Okay. Yep. And can, uh, did you, are we, we going to get some lights? I, I will eventually, yeah. I got to get the sheet rack up first. Oh, okay. Oh, I've got to wire the, the box that goes above the yes. sheet rack. Okay. All right. I lost a whole bunch of videos yesterday. Did you? Not after I uploaded them, but the card okay. went corrupt. So what I'll have you do tomorrow, Davis, is take care of that light for those, or the wire for those lights. Yeah. And then uh, you could take care of this. And here, are you going to be able to get that part? No, because my credit. It, oh, I well, City Electric is closed. Oh well, Tuesday then. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, when you're done with that, come up with me. Okay, I'm almost done with this. I'm gonna just ground. This I'm gonna be upstairs. So come upstairs. upstairs. Okay. Ew. Ground our box, and we'll have our tail to go to the uh, switches. Make sure that's tight. And we'll get our staple up here. Staple is going to win, so you know what? You don't even fight with them. I guess I'll do it down to here. So we are set for our switches here. So uh, we're not. This box is nowhere near being ready to be energized yet, because the utility company is going to turn it on out at the pole when we are ready. So I'm just going to tuck these wires back in here. 
This is where our two switches are going to go. And I'll bring the camera up close and show you up close what it looks like all done. So that is how to wire a lighting circuit, 14 American wire gauge on 15 amps out of the panel here in the country I was born in. Peace. Thanks for watching.